So I wanted to pop in and just film a last video. I went ahead and got some happy mail, of course, and I wanted to share with you all my happy mail and just really share what I got. So the first thing I think I'm going to open is this opal and fern sticker kit um, that I've received and I just love the packaging and I will keep the rope as well. I'm going to go ahead and pop that open. Oh, it's not with us. Okay, so I am so excited about this. I was actually waiting to get these stickers. So I have a die cut here. Look how beautiful that die cut is. Gorgeous, right? And then I got Cozy Night In. Tiramisu for two. Pink and cream. Oh my goodness, this is gorgeous. Oh, that is so beautiful. Cottage core. I saw plans with Jay's this and I was just like, yes. I love that. Everyday treasures. Meet me in New York. <laughs> Love this. I'm definitely going to be going to New York with my mom soon. Little green cottage. How cute is that? Look at this cute little couch. Patisserie. Oh, I just love it. And city walk. These are all... Oh my goodness. Look at that. So pretty. And then I got this bookmark. It says, no act of kindness, no matter how small, is ever wasted. So true. And I love the, the color of the bookmark. So pretty. Okay. So that is Opal and Fern. Next up, I'm just trying to make sure I have everything here. I got some Daisy paper stickers. So, I, of course, I ended up getting this week and next week. I also got some task stickers, to-do stickers, grocery stickers, film and edit stickers. And I know you've seen this in a couple of my videos that are probably going to go up before this, but I also bought those. Then a glittery life plans. I have here her Chanel coffee, which I already used a sticker, all black everything. Look how gorgeous that is. This is the home body sticker kit. So what I like doing is getting the full boxes and then getting the deco because for the Hobonichi weeks, this could be technically for a month. And then I can go ahead and basically just use the little deco, like two little deco stickers a week and kind of have it spread out with a kit. So I don't always use them in consecutive order, but sometimes I do. Then I got Seize the Day. Gorgeous, look at that. It's just, I love it, right? Then I have mood board, and this is definitely a mood board, like gorgeous. And I also got the note to self. I love this, and I also have a dashboard. I'll show you the dashboard in a minute. And a little deco stickers. Then Jador. Look at that. Oh. Oh, this is gorgeous. And then Fresh Start. So these are all ones that I've got in a recent sale that she had. And I purchased it because it was on sale and I was just like, okay, I'm definitely going to get it um, because it's a sale and I'm on a no buy. So I only buy what I need in terms of replenishing stickers for my planning. Other than that, I'm really not trying to purchase everything. And I also got some washies for the spring because the washies that I received 
are all washies that are more like fall and I purchased some washies that are more along for like spring and summer which is like florals and kind of like pink and brown colors so that's what I did and I think I'm good like if I run out of stickers from uh, Shop Daisy Papers I'll just write it on my Hobonichi but these stickers are absolutely gorgeous like look at the sectional so I really love getting inspired by stickers it really makes planning fun for me and therapeutic so love that and I just love this die cut now I did want to show you the um, note to self dashboard here and I also shared this on my Instagram stories but I will be sharing this again so this is my Notique Dusty Rose Lizard folio and it's completely a lizard folio that I love and right here in the front I have it with all these die cuts from Tool and Twine Co. I really love this because I think they're just really really gorgeous and it goes perfectly in the planner so it has planner girl here comes the sun little darling so each of them come with like a specific theme and I just decided to kind of put that on there I am probably gonna get these laminated but for right now I just really like them there and they're really really gorgeous like look at this detail so I really love opening this up and this is like my self-care planner and then it says here I'm very busy now the reason being that it says I'm very busy is because I'm very busy working on myself because <laughs> I need to um, and then I have another bow here from Tull and Twine Co so I just have that there but I want to go ahead and kind of stick it back so I'm gonna try to put that right in there okay so right in the front I have a dashboard from Tull and Twine Co so gorgeous I just love it and then where is that dashboard from the note to self collection so I'm just looking for that specific dashboard and then I'll talk about my other section that I have here for my self care here it goes so as you can see and I'm gonna go ahead and try to find the sticker kit that matches with that okay so here we go so this is the kit okay as you can see and right here it says Chanel so it has this basically enlarged and I just love the way that it looks it's so pretty and I just I just love that so I have this dashboard paired up with the speak love card from Gracie edits I purchased this a while ago and then of course sparkly peach Co's dividers which she is now permanently closed but I still have her stuff in here so I really do love how this just goes with that. So what I wanted to share is I have another die cut here. It's so cute. Like this die cut is everything. I love this die cut. And then I have the motivated set your goals. So this is like my self-care section here. And then in the front of the self-care section, I decided to put love here, right? And then what I love about Toll and Twine is that she sent this freebie and it goes perfectly with this. So I went ahead and put that there, put love here, and then I am on a journey to just track my moods, track the words. So I shared this on Instagram stories, but I also wanted to share it here because I think it's really important, especially if you are someone who's going through a lot and there's a lot of things that you are just noticing or exhaustion or moods this is something that you may want to consider and this is the planning with aloe collab with doa inspiring designs and i will link it down below i'm not an affiliate i'm not on her pr team i just really wanted to share this because i think this is a great system it has like the month here so i wrote out the month and then i still have to fill in this week but i have my hobonichi weeks and cousin to look and reflect of what happened this week and then I could write down my moods and then the word of that specific day which I also journal in my Hobonichi cousin so this is where this is going to come in so I really love this and then I just put in just highlighter what's really really important or what happened that day if it's like an errand or an appointment I will highlight that then my yearly goals which goes along with what I'm tracking and I will show you that in a minute and the words that you can use 
for this half page right here. So I really, really do love that. And if I don't want to use that, let's say like I don't want to use this, I have my cloth and paper as well here. So I can just also stick that in. So I don't necessarily have to use that. I can just use this to kind of look up the words and then I can just use the cloth and paper. So for me, it really, I have options there. And if you have the cloth and paper, you could also use that. And then now I'm going to show you what I'm doing here. So right here, this is something that I shared on Instagram stories. If you're not following me, go ahead and follow me, the minimal sophisticate on Instagram. But I shared this and this is basically the system that goes with this. So as you can see here, I have like the month and I'm just going to pull these out. And that's the beautiful thing about this is that, boom, you could just pull it out. So now you get a clear overview. So basically, I am tracking my moods, how I feel, and these goals right here, okay, see, sleep, eight hours, right, and then um, track moods, right, I'm doing that here, journal, uh, I have to write that here, so daily affirmation, journal, and I did journal this week, so I just have to write in the dates, skincare, um, I do this every single morning, and then social media, if I post it on Instagram, if I post it on YouTube, I have little color coding systems here now, so I know what to do, and then mainly the feeling of the day, like if I felt happy or frustrated, those are two feelings that I'm really trying to observe because as a caregiver, sometimes I feel exhaustion and, and frustrated at the same time, and then this is shifting my mindset, so these are actual thoughts of like, you know, that I thought about, like, I'm not enough, or I can't do this, I don't have a choice, um, this is too hard, I'm not a great daughter, because, you know, I, I'm, I'm not doing the best that I can, right, because I'm really hard on myself, uh, I have to change my thought process, and kind of shift that mindset, so I have that here, I am awesome, one step at a time, I always have a choice, my feelings are valid, with practice, it gets easier, I'll try differently, I'm doing the best, I can, which is so true. You have others who care and look at what you did. You are worthy. So these are all like positive affirmations. And I do have the definition of self-care, but I have it like tucked away because it's very personal for me. And I decided to kind of go deeper into it. So I'm just, I, I kind of took that out. But other than that, this is something new that I purchased in terms of just sharing my uh, self-care journey and it's part of my happy meal this is something that I did purchase because I feel like it's important to take care of yourself so I am doing that and I also have my goals in here so this is where my goals go and if I want to plan something for that day or if I want to use this planner I can definitely do that and that's what I'm going to do so I really really love this cute little happy meal that I purchased also, the Nautique disc cover in just the stone uh, crackle here. I just, I just love it. It's, it's really gorgeous. And I have the clear disc. They're a little harder to turn because the discs are from a different brand. Her, her metal disc and rose gold are absolutely divine. So, oh, and then I have like, do I have other? I do have. This is just another set of kind of like cards I have here. I have I am strong and I kind of put that there to the side because I just want it in there, I guess, but it's really just a good memory or reminder for me just to remind myself like I am strong. So it's in the back here and that's fine. I'm totally fine with it. And then I have more die cuts that I purchased from Tool and Twine Co. So this all came in her recent like spring box. Uh, or spring dashboard set and I just love it. I think it's so pretty and then if I want to flip it around like look See I could just flip my florals around Do my blue here and then I have like a beautiful blue basket and then this is her card if you also want to check her out on Etsy you can But this is where I purchased all my goodies here and I think it's just really good to have that there and I really do like it now the only thing is that when I take things out, I don't know if you all do this, but when I take my cards out and organize like my my planners, sometimes I'll be I'll just forget where I stack them and then I gotta go back and fix them, but that's fine. So those are all the new goodies I purchased. And this, let me let me show you this dashboard set, first of all, from Tool and Twine that just came out for spring is gorgeous. Look at this, look at this dashboard. Look at that dashboard. Here's another dashboard. Let me see if I can find it. Oh, 
And these cards, by the way, oh, I forgot to show you my cards. So I am worthy, I am capable, I am beautiful, I will forgive, I will be kind, I will hustle, I will grow, I am blessed, I am loved, I will be grateful, I will simplify. I love these affirmation cards. And then right here it says, I am enough. And I think this is so important because I definitely sometimes feel like I'm not enough or I'm not doing good enough and I'm hard on myself. And then I have this overlaid with the cloth and paper dashboard. It is only with gratitude that life becomes rich. So like I said, affirmations, gratitude. And then it says, I will be intentional, right? And I love that. Look at how beautiful that is. And look at this. Look at how it just completely goes with that. And then do I have another one here? I have my fortitude one. This is from Jane's Agenda. And then I have the section I showed you in front. So I am really happy with all the happy mail that I got. I think it's really, really beautiful. Just want to share that with you. So anyway, thank you so much for watching. And until the next video, bye.